Welcome to part two of Control. We are starting the second mission called Unknown Caller. Hope you guys enjoy. Please smash that subscribe button and drop a like. There it is again. A welcome message. What the hell happened here? Um... Oh shit. Damn! I believe that's all of them. So far, there's always gonna be more. Alright, we're cleansing another control point. Now this area is safe. Communications are on the right track. So this is where we have to go. All right. He just got knocked out. That looked creepy. An object of power. Looks like a piss of latched on here. We need to cleanse it. What is that? I guess we have to. Yeah, we have to reach. Oh, we learned how to crouch. Finally. 
very easy. Got the floppy disk. It's harder to hear you when I'm here. It's like the channel's been changed. The board's in charge here. Their pyramids in Bureau Seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not their director. I'm no one's director. Oh, that's really cool. You can pick stuff up and throw it. <laughs> Can't even make pathways. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that's... I enjoy throwing stuff at people. That's cool. It's very satisfying. The way they did it. The game just gets better and better. The more you play it, my opinion. Trophy unlocked. There you are. You were gone. Cut off. I got it. Just like you wanted, right? This will help me fight the hiss. that the hotline can be reached through the mail. So there's one of these crates in here. I'm not 100% sure what these crates are for yet. A weapon mod. So they give you stuff. That's really cool. Alright, so I found where I had to go. Let's just take a shortcut.
What is that? Some new. They can fly. Pretty difficult. You just gotta get used to. Great. I think I found a way to finally kill this bastard. Let's go, I finally got him. Not gonna lie, this took me about a couple tries. But we finally killed this I have tough bitch. And that's how you do it. If you're stuck on this part. The hotline should just be past crouch them. behind that, keep throwing stuff at him, and shoot him. It works. Roberto Tomasi, head of comms. The has got him. There's another paper over here. All right, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been... All right, take this down. The situation... ...evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious... The hotline can't be far now. Yeah, I hear it ringing. Okay, there we go. No. I definitely did I've it a little a too. There's a lot early. of roadside motels across the country, on the road, on the run, under the radar. This feels like all of them, like something recognized from a dream. Maybe it is. So I found what you had to do. You have to ring the bell until this door opens, and then you find a key with the black pyramid on it. And then from coming in here earlier, you already know that there's 
That's how you get in there. Figured out how to do it. I feel like this part's this I'm getting chills right now. Okay, never mind. Hello? Who's calling? Made it to the hotline. It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. Director needs a team, my management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. Didn't we already kill Tomasi though? Well, her nose is bleeding I have it. now. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. People react strongly when I tell them about you. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help. Um, what the? I guess that's a new type of enemy. We can just go to this control point and fast travel. Alright, so time to go speak with Emily. Which is. Let me just check them out. Jesse, did you get the hotline? I mean, how is it out there? The comms? The hiss? Sorry. You made it. I got the hotline. I could make out what Trench is saying now. Incredible. What did he say? He talked about his management team. People who knew the Bureau's secrets. Your boss, darling. Tomasi, but... He's gone. He's gone. Salvador? He's the head of security. And Marshall? Helen Marshall is head of operations. She's tough, ex-CIA. She took her rangers and went to the research sector to secure the HRA production. She hasn't come back. Someone who could help us. The other sectors. How do I get there? It's impossible because of the internal lockdown. You can perform a directorial override to lift it, but that can only be done in the maintenance sector. 
Normally, you take the sector elevator down there. It connects all the sectors, but it won't work while the lockdown is in effect. We already got past one lockdown. Maybe I can find a way. Jesse, look, with no prep, no training, in this extreme situation, you are doing phenomenally well. And all that and the hiss can't seem to affect you. I mean, I would love to run some tests on you. If you agree, that is. We could find out something that would help us. Tests? I don't know. She might find out about you. But I wouldn't mind understanding more myself. Okay. If you think it will help. Great. I'll check the internal documentation for any lockdown bypasses. We need to get these sectors open to locate Darling and Marshall. And I'll look for a way inside the maintenance sector. The sooner we find one, the sooner I reach this override. Do you hear that? Someone's singing. Where is it coming no. from? I'll go look. Okay, so we're going to end the video here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please drop a like and smash that subscribe button. Give me the 80. I'll see you on part three.